Any state, any entity, any ideology that fails to recognize the worth, the dignity, the rights of man, that state is obsolete. It has one iron rule. Logic is an enemy and truth is a menace. Oh, yeah. Oh. All right, guys, we're here at Murphy Oil in Freeport, Florida. Today is Tuesday, October 19th. It's about 9.30 in the morning. I'm out here today with Mr. Blind Justice, Ying Yang News, Dr. Sean Barry, and Alabama Transparency. And we are out here to see if they respect our right to record. got the restricted area authorized personnel only unauthorized access is a breach of security so we have a gentleman out here outside the fence looks like he is smoking Guys, this is right on the corner of Madison Street here. We've got some notices here. Restricted area, access point only. That's an authorized access point. It's for people to come out here and, and smoke. They're not allowed to smoke on the property, obviously. It's an oil refinery. Uh, so they have to come outside the gates. So we see this gentleman here doing. And, uh, you know, they've got a little smoking section. Some notices. All visitors and contractors must sign in. No trespassing. This area is under 24-hour CCTV surveillance. It's got security notices. Looks like they're doing a bit of construction work over here. And I heard them on top of one of the uh, on one of the tanks. Well, you can see in the background there, there's a crane and there's a bobcat over there. They're doing some stuff. I'm not sure if that big silo over there is associated with them. I don't think it is. I think that's on the other side of the river, the little inlet there. You can see there's a little inlet water back there. So... And it looks like, it looks like they're doing tanker trucks and not actually shipping it via water. We thought maybe this might be a port for them to, to fill up a, a boat, but it looks like tanker truck only. A river? Yep, Back right behind it. There. I don't know if you guys can see it, you can see a little bit of it right, right between there. Right, right in there, there's a river where the barges pull up and they use the cranes to offload the barges. To I'm gonna take a little walk, see down here. That guy definitely is going to go tell somebody. The guy that was out here smoking. There's a car behind you that, that turned and then slowed down. I, don't, it's, I think it sounded like it didn't turn off. Uh, he, like, he like slowed right here. I don't know if there's a stop sign or a yield sign, but he slowed and then he, he rolled right. And then he kind of, he never really picked up the speed. He kind of slowed down and then went into a stop. Yeah, he's sitting over there. There is a stop sign, but not right here. It's a little ways back. Yeah. What kind of car is it? It's like a red sports coupe or something. Okay. That's kind of weird for this little town. Yeah.
came out. Now it's coming back in, but not coming back in totally. Waiting here. Checking everything out, making sure everything's legit. Now the door's open on that car. Yeah. Yeah, I got the creeper vibe. It kind of just like, he or she just kind of slowly around it. And... Now they've stepped out. But they're just standing by the car. Okay, now they're walking up to whatever house that is or whatever. Thank you. This is a private facility. You can't film. Here. Yeah, we don't want to come on. Yeah, we're not. I, mean, I don't want to come in there. So. Yeah. You can't come in there, but you can't film our facility without our permission. Oh, we got uh, permission. From who? James Madison. Who's James Madison? James Madison. He wrote the uh, Bill of yeah, Rights. He wrote the Bill of Rights Constitution. Freedom of the Press. Yeah. Ring any bells? Freedom of speech. Yeah, you cannot film a private program. facility without permission from the facility. What's the reason? What law is that? I'm sorry. What is there? A, is that a law? Private property. Oh, well, I'm not on private property. Yes, sir. You are. No, sir. I'm on an easement. This is an easement. This is called a city easement because there's not a sidewalk. So what? What are y'all filming for? Because we're we're press. We're just gathering content on we're a story. Individual. Independent journalists just gathering content for a story. For a story about what? Well, industrial and, and yeah no we're just we rolling through the area looking at industrial sites today and we just happened to see this so we stopped so we don't need any help though you guys are fine you guys can go ahead and get back to work or do whatever you're doing well, you're obstructing our truck drivers that's the problem is what they're saying are they driving on the they drive on the the are grass here driving no, on the grass no, no, no but as they're coming in they don't want their trucks filmed they don't Oh, well, that's too bad. Tell them, yeah, that, that's terrible. You know, Tell them if they're driving on the road. You have no expectation of privacy. Yeah, they're, they're getting There's filmed. There's no such thing as privacy in public. Yeah, they're getting filmed all day driving on the road, so they're out of gas. There's cameras at every gas station, every building, every red light, whatever. It's filming these trucks all day. So who with? Uh, I'm with myself. I'm with me. I drove by myself. Can we get your names? I'm majorly awesome. I'm funky. The major's honorary. I'm a good citizen. Yeah, yeah, I am. I am. I, the major's honorary. You got a promotion to major now. His cousin Bartholomew, it was in the French Revolution. French Foreign Legion. French Foreign Legion is going to promote him to uh, general now. Be careful of the truck. Bro. Thank you, sir. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Y'all have a blessed day. We'll do our best. Not, like, trying to get in, y'all. Like, like, not dealing with criminal, nothing. Just, I mean, I, I understand. I see people, you know, I, I watch a bunch of internet videos with people, you know, doing what's right and whatnot, whatever. Is there just something like, like, like peculiar here or something? I'm just curious. Oh, not at all. Because I don't see stuff like this tomorrow. Yeah. Well, I mean, you got to see where we're coming from, though. I mean, we, we work here all the time, and we just see 
Right. You normal truck drivers in and out, people may be walking and whatnot, but we've right. never seen something like this, so it's just a little odd. You know but what I'm it, saying? It is the people that are not used to it. Yeah. You know, they're not used to people expressing their First Amendment rights. Oh, I understand. Right. I, I completely understand, yeah. But on a security level, you could see where we would kind of be like, hey, well, what's going on here? Okay, you know what I mean? Let me ask you this. I'm just talking about the security level. Yeah. Uh, do you guys stop the uh, social earth? Uh oh, let law enforcement handle it. Uh oh. Doesn't that guy on the left look like SGB? I don't know. Have you seen SGB? That guy looks that guy looks like him, SGB. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Where are you guys real? Where you got where you from? I'm from my mama. Blah blah blah. Even though we didn't have a good relationship, she was still my mama. Right? That's why I told Yin Yang, he's on the phone. Either calling to see what we're doing is legal, if he can do anything, or calling for backup. <laughs> I was just wondering if you folks got a call. No, we were patrolling the area. Okay, if so, I was just going to grab the incident number, that's all. Okay. Thanks, guys. Yep. They didn't get a call, they were just patrolling the area. Yep, no, so no. just stopped to see what was going on now, he's just chilling? Yeah. I guess we could sit here and chill and see how long the taxpayers are paying these guys to chill. I've got all day. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, my buddy's got one. Those things are awesome, man. Stuff just like this. Like, all right, just going to chill. Well, there's two chairs right here. Let's go sit.
Yeah. Well, yeah, let's go sit here. This is the old city hall. Yeah, that's They've left some equipment out here, two of them which appear to be seats. So, we can have a seat while we wait for these guys. Here we go, we're right here. Right, there's one. Yep, and here's one right next to you. Have a seat. Yep, that looks good. Oh, yep, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Director's chair. There it is. Action. What we got? Action. Well, right now we're. Oh, that's fine. I just was going to wait and see how long they were going to be here for. This guy come back out to take photos of us. Oh, the fire? Uh, the, 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 yeah, the Murphy Oil guy. He come over to take photos. I know I'm pretty handsome. You sure you don't want me to take off my glasses? There you go. Hey, you want me to autograph that picture for you? I've got a Sharpie in my pocket. You want me to autograph it? Hey, get a good picture of this. We the people know the truth. Amen. Thank you for your service, sir. I've done my time too, sir. Hey, thank you. Thank you for thank you. Hey, those guys might be impeding your trucks. Is that one of the trucks? Yeah, it's right in front, right in front of us waiting to go in, but the, the cops are over there by the gate, like, backing <laughs> in. So I, I wonder if the cops are going to sit up here all day as a protection squad. They'll sit here till we leave. Will they? Oh, yeah, I'm sure that's what that guy's gonna tell him. You know, that's why he backed up over there. That's fine. So why stay? If he wasn't called, why stay? Yeah. You know. You should ask him. Like, can any can any business call you guys to be security all day? Yeah. And well, you're getting. Are double, you gonna charge? Yeah. Would you charge the business? Isn't that double dipping? Yeah. You mm -hmm. know, you charge the business for security when you get a call, but you're also getting taxpayer money. Yeah. So that's double dipping. Yeah, we should ask them, hey, you guys, guys charge for your security work, or is it, can any business have you guys do security all day? It's the spot right here, though, man. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's it in, is the nice in the shade. They provided yeah. us chairs and everything. That's what I was to say. They brought us chairs, garbage cans, some lights, yeah. garden lights. Hey, Alan Roth, that's some pretty nice stuff. Allen Rock is a pretty good company. Oh, I bet. It's just the old city hall. They spared no expense. Right. <laughs>